Today we have a stand-up with Ms. Varner about the ACT prep class. Hey Vikes, I'm Sage. And I'm Gage. And here you're watching SVTV. We are making stories by teens for teens. Creating a platform. Finding character. And giving others a voice. This is SVTV. Today is your last day to turn in your dual enrollment forms for Washburn. Give them to Ms. Varner today. The spring ACT prep class is set for Thursday, February 13th. Kylie caught up with Ms. Varner to find out more. All right, I'm here with Ms. Varner to talk about the spring ACT class. So what do students need to know? They need to know that uh, registration is happening now and it's available. There's forms in the front office. There's also an online link that's been posted um, on the, the Schoology pages. Um, it is happening on Thursday, February 13th. You guys do not have school that day, but if you're registered for the ACT prep class, you do need to be here. Class starts at 7.30 in the morning. Um, and it is geared to help you improve the test scores. It goes over some of the content, but more so the strategy of the test. All right, is there anything else? Um, no, um, other than if you have any questions, just swing by the front office and either ask myself or Mrs. Welch. All right, thank you. Back to your anchors. Make sure to get signed up for that if you're interested. Now over to Gage with the sports. What's up guys? It's your guy Elias Mosier here and hey, I got a great product for you. It's called SVTV live streaming, okay? We want to get this done so we can see all those sports like go touchdown bowl, man. Like get a strike, my dude, and golf. Like, you know, these great sports. If you want to see them live, all you got to do is go down and hit that subscribe button. Just smash that subscribe button, guys. Don't forget to turn on that bell notification and like the video. Thanks, guy. See you later. Hey, I'm going to go home and watch some Disney Plus. See you tomorrow. Be safe. There's supposed to be a nasty storm. We're tracking round two of winter weather this week. Look at this, a much more widespread area of snow. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. Hi, my name's Elias Mosier, and I used to not be able to do parkour. You see, I got so tired because I had a lack of vitamins. But with the help of salad, I've got all the vitamins I need. I can just nozzle this stuff down. Mmm, delish. And now I have all the vitamins to do all this great parkour. We return you now to your regularly scheduled program. Hawaiian is the theme for tonight's game. Friday at 1.15, Jeffrey Halstead will sign a letter of intent to play soccer at Heston College. Congratulations, Jeffrey. Boys basketball at McPherson is at 3 to 5. JV wrestling at Holton, 3.30 to 8. Wrestling at BC Northwest, 4 to 9. Girls basketball at T High, 5.30 to 8.30. Now over to Josh with the weather. Good afternoon. We had some snow last night into this morning that totaled eight tenths of an inch at the Billard Airport, and that puts our season total up to ten and a half inches, which is over two inches below where we should be for this time of year. So we have had some snow, but overall for the season, we still are running a deficit in terms of snowfall. Now today, some of the snow will start to melt, but the big story is going to be the cold. Check out these wind chills for your Friday in the mid 20s this afternoon, and they will drop down to the low 20s as the wind starts to let up, but the temperatures drop by tomorrow morning. So it is going to be feeling a lot like January today. And because January is National Soup Month, I figured we'd show you the soup eating index because it is a 10 out of 10 with those very cold temperatures, maybe you can enjoy some soup 
in your house tonight. Here's the seven day forecast. You can see that after today is cold, we will start to warm up the weekend highs in the 40s and that will pretty much continue all the way through Tuesday and even Thursday of next week when we do add a slight chance of rain or snow. Right now, neither of those appear to be major systems. Now back to your anchors. If you want your TikToks to be featured on SVTV, make sure to send them to us on Instagram or Snapchat. That's all for today, Vikes. Have a good rest of your day.